What's going on everyone? Welcome to another Keyshot Quick Tip. In this video, we'll take a look at Keyshot 10's all new solo mode and get a better idea of how it can be used to augment your existing workflows. Solo mode is a great tool for speeding up material applications and editing when working with scenes that have multiple parts or models. It's a pretty straightforward feature that simplifies existing workflows by making part isolation simple and intuitive. However, previous workflows such as locking apart and hiding all, and alt left mouse button still work. To toggle solo mode on or off, either use the hotkey S or right click your part and select solo mode. This will cause the non-selected parts to be hidden and the selected part or parts to be isolated for editing. To toggle out of solo mode, simply right click and select exit solo mode from the pop-up menu or again, use the hotkey S. Solo mode can also be used to isolate selections of parts as well. If you are trying to isolate a selection, you can either highlight the parts you want to isolate in the real-time window, or you can control or shift select them from the scene tree in the project panel. Once selected, be sure to right-click one of the selected parts in the real-time view and follow the same procedure you would for isolating a single part. Right-click and select solo mode from the pop-up menu or use the hotkey S. If done correctly, the parts you wanted to isolate will now be the only visible parts in the real-time view. Thanks for watching this Keyshot 10 quick tip. If you're interested in more useful Keyshot content, hit that subscribe button and get notified as soon as new videos hit the channel. Don't forget to let us know your thoughts on this tutorial in the comment section below, and if you found this video useful, give it a like and share with your friends.